Thank you, Mr. President, for joining us today. As you know, early voting started today in Tennessee, and I can't think of a better way to kick it off than having you join us tonight. Tennesseans strongly support you, and we love you here. And I can't tell you how honored I am to have your support. I promise you, sir, that when the Tennesseans send me to the Senate, I'm going to be your strongest ally there. Here in Tennessee, we're working hard to ensure you're reelected for four more years so we can continue to keep America great. Because when you look around and you see this angry liberal mob, you see what's happening in Portland, Oregon, that can't happen across this country. And Tennesseans are so grateful for your leadership here to make sure it never does. You've been clear that with you as our president, America will never be a socialist country. Yet that's exactly what this angry liberal mob wants. They seek to destroy the America we know and love. They want to ruin everything that makes this country great. Your leadership is even more important now than ever. And I want to thank you for all that you're doing for us and for this country. Mr. President, I'll turn it over to you. Well, Bill, I want to thank you, and I want to just congratulate you. I hear you're doing great in one of my very favorite places in the world. We've had a tremendous relationship. It's been something that has been very special, very important. We've had some of the best rallies ever. And as you know, because of uh, COVID, as they call it, COVID-19, we can call it a 100 different things, the China virus, if you want. You can call it whatever you want, but uh, they should have stopped it. They should have never allowed it to come here. But it did, and they did, and it's too bad. But because we, we had some of the great rallies for Marsha Blackburn, who's been a phenomenal senator, I have to tell you. And I'm so proud of her. She works so hard, and she loves the people of Tennessee so much. And I said, now we've got to do it again. And uh, I know I had plenty of choice, and Bill Haggerty is somebody that I know very well. He was my ambassador to Japan. He was a fantastic ambassador. I'll never forget, I went to Japan. He knew every person over there. He knew the businessmen. He could pronounce those names that I had a hard time with. I had a very hard time with some of those names. And uh, it was amazing. He was one of the truly great ambassadors that I've ever met. And I've met some good ones, and I've met some very bad ones, to be honest with you. But Bill was so solid, so good, and... Uh, they still miss him, I will tell you. They still miss him over there. So he said he wanted to run He wanted to run for the Senate from a state that he loves. So I'm calling to tell everybody in Tennessee to get out and vote early. You can get out there right now and vote for Ambassador Bill Haggerty for Senate. Uh, early voting starts, uh, I guess it starts on August. Uh, it starts immediately and it ends on August 1st. And it's something that's so important. you got a real primary here, and the other side spending a lot of money. But Bill is somebody that will just never, ever let you down. He'll go so far out, he'll never let you down. I've known Bill for a long time. He was one of my earliest supporters. He worked on my campaign in 2016 and my transition after we won. He's been so great in so many ways, and we need to – Send, you know, we need to send great conservative voices out there. One of the things that you probably heard that I've done and gotten a lot of credit for are judges. We've put in, by the end of the first term, we'll have almost 300 judges uh, appointed, which I think is a record. It's got to be pretty close to a record. Uh, President Obama allowed us to have 142 because he was unable to get them approved or he did it too late. And so I ended up with 142. Rarely do you end up with any. Usually when you're president, you go and you get nothing. But we also have two great Supreme Court judge justices. And I will tell you, this is very important because you see what's going on with the votes in the Supreme Court. And it's very even right now. And uh, the choice, the Supreme Court justice choice is going to be very important that I won't let you down. The next president, hopefully that's going to be us for another four years because Nobody's done what we've done. Nobody has done, no other president has done as much and as good as we've done in the first four years of a term. And we've got possibly two, three, or even four Supreme Court justice picks during this, uh, during this term. So we have to, you know, I want all the help I can get. Bill and, and senators have to get those justices approved, and Bill will be leading the pack. We want uh, somebody that's tough in China, and that's going to be Bill. As you know, the wall is going to be closed and, and almost finished. You see the kind of record numbers we're doing at the wall. We're letting nobody come through unless they come through legally. And we do allow, for the farmers out there and ranchers who are doing 
tremendously well because of what I've done with China. We've got $28 billion, $16 billion and $12 billion to the farmers and ranchers paid to by paid, given by, by China, and uh, it was in the form of tariffs. They, China, by the way, had the worst year they've had in 67 years, and we were having the best year we've ever had anywhere in the world. The, no country has ever done what we were doing, and then I had to close it in order to save tremendous numbers of lives. And we saved literally millions of lives, and now we're open again. We've got to get our children back to school, by the way. Have to get them back to school. But Bill stands tall for law and order, and he'll protect and defend your Second Amendment, which is so important. And don't kid yourself, your Second Amendment is under siege. If I weren't here, I don't think you'd have a Second Amendment, or you would certainly have a very weak one. So we have uh, we are standing strong and tall for your Second Amendment. If you look at Pelosi and Schumer and AOC plus three and all of these people, they don't want you to have a Second Amendment. They don't want guns anywhere. They want to take them away, and you need them for lots of reasons, but you also need them for your own protection, and you wouldn't have that right. In my opinion, that would be one of the things they do very quickly is they would really decapitate your Second Amendment. I'm proud to give my good friend Bill Haggerty my complete and total endorsement. He will never, ever do something that the people of Tennessee, the great people of Tennessee that I love, that I had a tremendous, not only a victory, we had a landslide victory, but uh, he will never do anything except for great for his friends. He loves the people of Tennessee as I do. So if you could get out and vote early, voting is now, you can vote early. And uh, Bill will be so good. He will do such a good job. He'll be winning on November 3rd along with me. So thank you very much, Tennessee. Bill and your family, go out, have a good time, get everybody out and vote. He will never let us down. Thank you very much, Tennessee. I'll see you soon. Thank you so much, Mr. President. I'm thank honored you very to much, Bill. Support. Yeah, I'm so honored to have your support. I've worked along, alongside you now for over four years, and it's been such an honor. Uh, I'm just a small town kid, you know, from Gallatin, Tennessee, who could have never imagined that I'd have the chance to work so closely with the President of the United States, and not just any President, for you, someone who's worked so hard to put America first. It's the honor and privilege of a lifetime. I've been so blessed to live the American dream, and that's why I'm running for Senate, to work with you to preserve the American dream for my children and for children across Tennessee. And to have you on the phone with us now, kicking off our voting season, I just can't thank you enough. And I'll promise you this, I'm going to work alongside you to strengthen our economy, bring our supply chains back from China, get back to made in the USA. Together we'll stop illegal immigration. I'm going to help you build the wall. I'll protect the unborn and stand tall for our law enforcement officers, our military, and our veterans. We're going to continue implementing your America First agenda to keep America safe and secure. I want to thank everyone who's joined us tonight for our Pelotown Hall with our President, Donald Trump. And thank you for your time tonight, Mr. President. Your support means everything. God bless Tennessee. God bless America. And God bless you, President Trump. We've got you in our prayers, sir. Thank you very much, Bill. And thank you, everybody. Go out and vote, and I'll see you soon. Thank you very much. Bye. Bye.